and she gave me everything. I handed her 50 bucks and I got a lot of stuff. So this is why you always ask if they have extra video game stuff when you're when you find a bundle. What's up guys? How are we doing today? Retro Obsessed back with another video. I got just a small video today, just a little something I picked up from OfferUp. And just like the title says, this is why you should always ask if they have extra video games on a sale. Let's check it out. Check it out. Welcome back to the channel y'all. How are we doing today? My name is Tom aka Retro Obsessed. It's an obsession. If you are new here, welcome to the channel. Welcome aboard. I am obsessed with all things retro from video games, music, movies, toys, anything and everything from the 80s, the 90s, early 2000s. Um, I kind of show that it is possible in even today's day and age that you can still find uh, stuff, you can still find video games, you can still find good deals out in the wild. It just takes some hunting. That's what the channel is about. If you like the kind of content, go ahead and do me a favor right now. Hit that subscribe button, hit the bell to be notified of my new videos coming out every couple weeks for you. In today's video, I'm going over an offer up deal that I found about a week ago. I thought I went downhill after a couple days and it ended up, uh, they messaged me back and had some more stuff and we're here today. About a week ago, I found a deal on, on OfferUp. It was, I believe it was about mm, 12 Nintendo Wii games, maybe 10, 12, somewhere around there. But there were some good, good titles in there that I knew was worth at least, at least that amount, if not a little bit more. And I knew most of them I needed for my personal collection. And lo and behold, I said, hey, just curious, do you have any more uh, video game stuff. I, you know, I'm a video game collector. I collect anything. I don't have any other stuff except for Nintendo Wii stuff besides the games. Uh, my kids left all their Nintendo Wii stuff here. You know, I, I just, I don't want it anymore. Uh, I just want to get rid of it. I was like, okay. She goes, if you want, um, text me or sit, tell me your phone number. I'll text you some pictures of what I have and how much I'm looking for everything. Okay. I'm like, okay, well, I'll text her and see what they say. What they say. Um, they sent me a bunch of pictures, uh, some good, good stuff. I was like, okay, this is cool. How much do you want for it? She goes, um, uh, how about 60 bucks? I'm like, okay, that's a good deal. Um, but apparently what happened is once I said, okay, um, actually I countered offered with 50 bucks. I was like, okay, would you do, would you happen to do 50 bucks for everything? I'll come pick it up, you know, let me know. And I didn't hear anything back for about three days. So I'm like, okay, maybe I upset her. You know, it happens. Uh, they just didn't want that low amount, you know, low ball offer. So I was like, you know, it is what it is. Um, I, I missed a good deal. You know, I should have just spent the 60 because it was a good deal. Uh, she messaged me back literally last night saying, hey, do you still want the stuff? I'll give it to you for 50 bucks. And when I opened up my messenger on my phone, uh, the message that I said said, okay, I'll do the deal for 60 bucks. That's not a big deal. Apparently I never hit send. It was still sitting in the text message box to hit send. So I'm like, okay, erase that. And I was like, okay, that's fine. Thank you very much. I'll take it for 50. I appreciate it. Um, she goes, can you come get it now? I'm like, no, I'm, I'm you know, busy with my daughter's doing basketball tryouts. I was like, I will come tomorrow morning about seven o'clock in the morning. Um, you know, that's when I take my daughter to school. She goes, okay, good deal. She texted me this morning and said, hey, come, uh, if you can come pick it up now, that's great. I was like, okay, that's perfect. I just dropped my daughter off. Boom, went to her house, which is, was literally like seven minutes down the road. And she gave me everything. I handed her 50 bucks and I got a lot of stuff. So this is why you always ask if they have extra video game stuff when you are when you find a bundle. Uh, FYI, I never find any good deals anymore on OfferUp. It is very, very slim pickings. Everyone wants gold. Everyone wants $100 for a freaking Sony Trinitron TV. They want $100 for a Nintendo Wii loose. Uh, I very, very seldom find good deals like this. But when I find a decent deal like this, this is when I ask if they have any extra stuff because they can usually bundle it together and get it for a decent deal. So um, I'm going to go through it with you guys right now because I literally have not went through any of this stuff yet. I'm going to go through it right now. Uh, so the first thing first, first, things first on the is what I got is this. This is the Nintendo Wii Red 25th Anniversary Edition Bundle Complete Inbox 
Hopefully, we're gonna we're gonna open it up right now. This is what I saw in the picture. I knew this was a good deal. Um, I, I do have a red one, a loose, so I'm actually gonna sell my loose red one and then keep this one brand new in the box. Well, not brand new, but complete in box. Very, very cool. Um, I'm gonna open it up with you guys right now and see exactly what's in here. And hopefully we have Super Mario Brothers Wii because I do not have that actually in the collection uh, for some odd reason. I think I sold it to a friend that needed one for her son, so I ended up selling mine. Uh, Wii Sports is always, always a great seller. I already have Wii Sports. Boom, that's automatically 25 to 30 bucks on my eBay store right there. I've already cooped back three quarters of my money just from this game alone. Awesome, awesome, awesome deal here. Very clean condition box. I mean, it's got a little wrinkly dues here and there, but super clean condition. So. Um, I am going to open this box right now in front of you guys. I have not opened it yet and see exactly, make sure everything is in here. Then we'll go over the bag that she gave me too. So we're going to open it up for the first time right now. And it looks like everything is in there. Now one and two boxes. So we're going to open up number one first. And you can see there, looks like it's missing the Wii. So hopefully it's in the bag. <laughs> So we have a uh, two-year replacement plan, uh, looks like a thing that came with it. Uh, Wii Sports Manual. Uh, we have some books, books here. Okay, so this is Animal Crossing City Folk uh, Instruction Manual. Uh, Disney Infinity Instruction Manual. Like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at this at the same time you are. So, uh, so this is a Nintendo Wii Will uh, Manual. And Super Mario Brothers Wii manual. So I'm hoping the games are in the bag. So let's see, we go down here, and there's some more, some more paperwork, Universal Remote Control, uh, more inserts for the games, more inserts for the games, Wii Fit Plus, Nintendo Wii Club, Super Mario Wii, another instruction manual, uh, the Wii instruction booklet, the Wii operations manual, and then just the inserts, but. The box itself is empty, so I'll put that right there, and we're going to open up box number two, see what we got in here. Oh, man, I think I got a switcheroo, guys. Look at it. Wah, 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 a white Wii. Damn, that sucks. Oh, let's see what we got here. <laughs> let's see what we got. Eh, eh. So just a basic Wii, first generation, backwards compatible, uh, GameCube, it looks like it's missing the top piece. That's kind of a bummer. Uh, we will plug it in, see if we have any game in there, but for now, that's definitely a bummer. That's kind of a bummer. Let down, I was really, really looking forward to having that red one in the box, for the personal collection at least. So let's close this up here. So that's a bummer, but at least it's a cool box. I mean. I still haven't went through the bag yet. Let's uh, fingers crossed, but still a cool box though. So we're gonna go through the through that bag. We have a big bag here. I mean, a big bag full of stuff, um, and we're gonna go through it. And okay, so it looks like we have um, Disney Infinity characters. So we have uh, the uh, the Incredibles. What is that? Flash and Mr. Incredible. And the little girl, I think, what is uh, what is her name? Elastic Girl. Uh, was it Frozen? Elsa, Anna, whatever, whichever her is. Uh, Captain Jack Sparrow. These are kind of cool. My son plays these, so he'll like these. Uh, Sully from Monsters. Um, another Elsa, Elsa or Anna, one of the two. Um, and the mom to the Incredibles, I forgot her name. And then this Crystal. Uh, let's see here, Monsters Inc. Uh, Pirates of the Caribbean, little like cubic skull or a cubic uh, stone. And then a, don't know what that is. I'm assuming that's maybe to go with the with the, in Disney Infinity stuff. Oh yeah, it says Disney Infinity right on it. So, so that box has Disney Infinity stuff. Oh, that's a bummer. Okay, next up here, we have a Mario Kart Wii uh, steering wheel, empty. But I do have the instruction manual, so I'll put that in here. Um, that'll go on my shelf. Looks like we have the Disney Infinity Pad. So, man, that's a bummer. I'm actually kind of bummed about this video now. But, you know, it happens. You know, it is what it is. But we'll, we'll keep on digging through the bag and see what we got going on here. So we got all the wires here. So 
So this is kind of cool. I actually don't have one of these yet. Let me untangle it from the mess here. So we have the red Nintendo Wii nunchuck. Um, I do have the red Nintendo Wii controller, so I'll be able to pair it up and match it with that one. So that's kind of cool. And then we have a standard white, white nunchuck. We have a black nunchuck. We have a tennis racket that doesn't have the bottom piece so far. And bag's empty, that's a bummer. So the red Wii isn't in there, but we got um, some video games here. Oh, let me let me open it up here. We got some video games. So, so we got a game party. Are you smarter than a fifth grader? Make the grade. Uh, Thrillville off the rails. Uh, sleepover party. This is Disney Infinity that goes with all the other Infinity stuff. Uh, My Sims Party. Pinball Hall of Fame, the Williams Collection. Like I said, these are all CIB as well. So that's nice. This is Sean White Snowboarding Road Trip Target Limited Edition. That's kind of cool. I think I might have that. Uh, My Sims and My Sims Racing. Uh, we Love Golf. Uh, Zumba Fitness and We Your Shape with Jenny McCarthy. And that is officially it. So needless to say, I am bummed after all. It was missing the red Wii out of the box. The Wii itself is missing the cover. Uh, we are missing Wii Sports. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and open this right now and, and I just realized that there's no power cord or AV cord or regular controllers. Damn it, that's a bummer. And there was no Animal Crossing and no Super Mario's Wii. That's a bummer. I guess they they say you should always check your stuff before you buy it. I did, I did buy it blindly. It is uh, unfortunately a bummer. Uh, these games don't appear to have any, some, any value, um, but I do still will use them for my collection, maybe three, four dollars a piece. So with that being said, it is a bummer. I don't even have the Wii wheel. Um, I do have an extra Wii wheel, so I'm gonna put it in here. I can have it complete in the box and put it up on my Wii, on my Wii collection. That's fine, that's cool. So I got that for the collection. Um, I do have the red Wii box. I might keep this because I do have a red Wii. So I think I'm going to keep this, put my red Wii, uh, not really in it, but I'm gonna have this for display purposes. So at least I got a really cool red Wii uh, box, all the instruction manuals, all the paperwork, all that good stuff. I got a backwards compatible Wii, uh, no control, no wires, but I have a shit ton of wires for them. You know, I always come across them in the wild loose, so not a big deal, I'll just complete it um, and I'll turn around and sell it. And right now, these are going for about 75 bucks on eBay complete. Um, I can bundle up some games, a steering wheel set, and a Wii Fit board, and probably get like a $125 nice little bundle package. So either way, I'm gonna be making money off of it. It's just a bummer that the stuff that was actually pictured actually wasn't included, especially the Mario Brothers Wii. I was really looking forward to that game, and then the Mario, uh, or the Wii Sports, because that's an easy 25, 30 bucks right now. So, bummer. It is what it is, you know, this is what happens when you find stuff in the wild. Sometimes it goes your way, sometimes it doesn't. Either way, uh, 50 bucks, I think, somewhat well spent. Um, I didn't get exactly what I wanted, but I got some decent stuff for the collection. I will recoup my money back. Um, and for just for the Wii, just for the, the white Wii alone, you can get about 75 bucks now on eBay, which is insane, so. But it is what it is. Uh, I got to add some nice stuff for the collection. Um, before I go, Let's turn this baby on and see if there's a game in it. So uh, let me gra grab my power cord and plug it in and let's see what we got. All right, so you guys are gonna see it firsthand. There's no gonna be tricks. Uh, I'm gonna plug this in right here, uh, turn it on and see if we got anything inside. So let's plug it in. See right there, the red, red light, wherever it's at. We're gonna power it on. Hopefully it powers on, you see the green light there. Uh, eject. Let's hope for the best, you guys. Hope for the best. Let's see. Eject. Nothing. Wah, wah, wah. 
It is what it is. This is what happens when we go on hunting in the wild. Sometimes you win some, sometimes you lose some. I'm still going to be making money off of this. I have power cords, I have sensors, I have extra controllers. I will bundle this stuff together, bundle a couple of games together, steering wheel, we fit. I'll make about 125 bucks off this deal. Either way, I'm making money. I will get at least double my investment in here. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. I uh, hope you guys found out that you can still find stuff in the wild. Just pay a little bit more attention than I do because I just usually just randomly get stuff. Uh, but this is how I got a massive video collection in about three years. I got 50 consoles, 1,500 video games, biggest uh, Sony Trinitron TVs ever made. All this stuff was found in the wild. Pretty, pretty cool. Hope you guys enjoyed. I am Tom, a.k.a. Retro Obsessed. It's an obsession. Have a good one, y'all. Be safe out there. Peace.